Hi everyone, it's Karen. Thanks for stopping by. I just have a little bit of a haul from Dollar Tree and Target and a little bit of Michael's. So I just thought I'd share with you. Even though a lot of the things you're going to see, you guys have that in your Michael's. I mean, you're at Dollar Tree probably all the time. However, we never have anything. So a few things are new. So let's start with Target first. Now I haven't been into Target in a while and you know the dollar spot that's really not a dollar anymore. You're lucky if you find something that's a dollar and not three or five dollars, which is fine. I don't know why it's a big deal that they just can't see or say, you know, three or one, three, five section or whatever. So anyway, um, I just got in there and I got two chalkboard houses and I'm not saying that they're going to stay chalkboards, but they're, that's what they are. And then I saw, oh, for my grandson to be, for my grandson's baby shower, which is this Sunday, I'm making a golf cart, um, diaper cake and I'll show you when it's done and if um, anybody wants to see how I did it and it was just trial and error so it's not the best thing that you've ever seen trust me and the friend I was with said that her son loved this toothbrush I bought it if I mean there's like a what do you call it a raving review and I gotta go with it I got two of these little stools because they're so cute however the other one the leg just fell out and whatever. So you can't go with that. Um, and I got, what else did I get at Target? Oh, with the golf cart um, bait, diaper cake that I'm making, I needed more, I needed bibs that were gonna go with what I have. I'm not even sure if these are gonna work, even though they're both made by the same company, which is Carter's, I believe. Oh, no, these are Cloud Island. I kind of felt like I could probably get them to work. So we'll have to see. And then, oh, I bought some biggies. And I don't know what you call them, but my family, these have always, probably and always will be called biggies because it's a really cute name and that's why. All right, so, oh, okay. oh yes, I have one more bag. Okay, so just as, um, ooh, sorry about that. My phone is not um, charged, so it's plugged in. All right, so we had the problem with the stools, and then um, I bought this, and it was $5, and it's already fallen apart. So I'm trying to find... Uh, there must be a piece that fell off. I don't know, but it doesn't work right now. We're going to work on that. Um, oh, I got these. Boston Red Sox. I mean, everyone needs one of these, no matter what size they are. But it comes with little booties, a little bib, and a little onesie. So cute. All right, you can go there. Uh, and up uh, another spinny thing. And you can put all of either paintbrushes or all of my cricket scrapers and hokey pokies because I lose them all the time. So I thought this was perfect and it was five dollars. So I think that was it from Target, except um as we were leaving, they had this. It's so soft. And it was only $5. And I thought, you know, look at this. How cute is that for the little bunny? So that's what I got at Target. All right. Done with Target, I think. Oh, no. A couple more things. These are just your basics. Let me see what this is. Nothing. All right. So 
I needed this color for my diaper cake. I'm still trying to get everything together for the Hot Wheels stuff I'm getting to keep at my mother's house. I found one of these. These are so hard to come by um, in my Dollar Tree. And I got this little twine that has off-white kind of just together, wrapped around together in there. So then we went to Dollar Tree and I purchased the, I got two of these because I'm thinking that I might be able to stick my golf bag on it and this will make it stand up. I don't know if that's going to work or not. Just giving it a shot. I thought it was a cute idea. We shall find out. Um, I bought two of these because a couple of people have said that these are going to be made in a smaller size than this, which could possibly be a great thing because sometimes you want a smaller one. So just to make sure I didn't run out, I got two of those. And then I go, oh, this must be the piece to the spinny thing. Um, I got some paper straws and I know I have some, but just in case, just in case, that's it, just in case. I'll use the blue and the green um, on the candy table because the colors are blue and white, but there's not enough. I will look to see if I have I know I do. I'll see if I can find them. Let's call it that. So I got to find the blue ones. I was able to purchase these, which are hard to come by. And I got the silver because you can paint on top of it. And I thought it would be cute. I got these little socks. And normally I would not purchase socks at Dollar Tree, but he's a tiny baby. And these actually look big. So um, but they're very cushioned. They're really soft. So I said, what the heck? And I got them. I found this. Isn't that adorable? Of course, I will paint over the glitter. And just, this is flat. So you can basically stick stuff on, pop it off for each season. Um, oh, I got another one of these. I also got this hippity hoppity sign so I could have these. That's really all I bought it for was the bunnies. And to get some to go with it, I bought this. So now I have all the bunnies. And I'm sure I'll do something with the rest of the sign. And I'm apologizing for needing to drink, but I'm on a couple of medications that make my, my mouth dry. And that is one of the side effects, so I apologize. Now, what else? Okay, I'm afraid this is gonna fall because I don't think it's tight. All right, so walked, oh, bought these for the dogs because they love them. They're called uh, Canine Carryouts Taco Minis, and they love them. I mean, here's the truth to that. I bought, so I got two packs of those. I bought, first time I've seen the cereal, so I got the toasted oats, the apple bits, and the fruit rings. And I know this is backwards, and I apologize. I don't understand. It never happened to me before, so doing something different. I just don't know what. All right. Then I got, where are you? All right. So I walked into the Dollar Tree and right in front of my eyes is this whole nautical um, beach section, section, section. Oh my God. Section. Anyway. <laughs> um, and I don't have a beach. I mean, we go to the beach. My sister has a beautiful beach house. Two of my sisters do. And um, so I 
I might change all the words to pool because I got a pool. So um, I got this. It's a beach thing. The thing with me is houses. If it's a house, I'll buy it. Um, and I don't care where what it says because it's a house, so it needs to be bought. I thought I got two of those. But apparently not. So then move on to, I mean, really, is that not the cutest thing? So I did get two, oh, I mean, three, because you never know when you're going to need an anchor. And it's got a lot of the um, texture to it, so it's going to be adorable. Then I got this. I don't know if it's called twine, uh, decorative jute rope and it's navy. Well, it's like a, it's like a cornflower blue. It's not navy. It's a little bit lighter. So I got a, just a couple of these because you don't want to get stuck with missing some and it's gone from your store forever. So there's a couple more. And one more. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. All right. Six of these just because you never know. I then purchased. Oops, that's done. I then purchased this sign that says, let the sea set you free. And um, it's in a slot. And I wonder if you could take it out. I mean, probably. But anyway, I thought that was cute. And I think I bought two because that's what you're supposed to do. More Hot Wheels for my my mother. Um, I bought another house that says on beach time, which could be pool because we got a pool. Then I got these little clothespin sailboats. I thought they were cute. Again, I don't have a sailboat, but um, they had cute ribbon. This is seahorses with uh, coral. And I know this more. We'll find it. Then I never saw these at our store, but they're little shells, all different kinds. Thought those were cute. And this has nothing to do with the beach, but how many times are you looking for a pin? Never saw these before, but now I've got safety pins. And let's see. Up. Oh, then they had these tin buckets. And this one is a seahorse. And this one is a starfish. Love that. All right. Moving right along. I then saw this. And I was like, oh my God, that's so cute. Since I know this is probably backwards, it says, all you need is love and the beach. And then I got it. This one says, gone to the beach in a little sailboat kind of thingy. All right, then I got a couple of these. So it says, relax. And beach. So relax at the beach. Who knows? Adorable. And I don't know why I just have a thing. I don't even have a thing with the beach. Like, I don't crave to go to the beach. If I go to my sister's house, I don't say, let's all run to the beach. I just like the whole thing about the beach. I don't mind going to the beach either. I'm just saying, you know. So then they had all this adorable fabric with all kinds of beach things. So I also, one of my best friends has a house down the beach in Rhode Island, not Mass. So then, you know, I got more of this because you always just need that. Then they had other ribbon. They had bumblebees, which I got some 
feast up at Michael's last week or something. Um, and a lighthouse and some lace. And I know I have more. It's got to be in a different bag. So then I got sea turtles and dolphins. Again, never saw them at my my store, so I had to get those. Um, then, so I have this um, candy table at the um, Speak Karen, the candy table at the baby shower. So they had these little glass bottles that I thought would be cute on the table because all the candy is blue or white and a little bit of yellow. So I got this one with the starfish. I got this one with a metal starfish. And I got this one with its square, um, I don't know, some black stuff on it, but that had a fish. I thought those were adorable. So just so you know, my dog is still sitting here staring at those little cookies. Oh, here's some more. So here are the sea turtles and the dolphins. I must have got more, but then let's see. I got these adorable little clips on clothespins. I don't know what to do with them, but I love them. And you could pull the clothespin off and glue them to a scrapbooking page or a card. They're very thin. I could probably cut them with my Glowforge, which I don't know if I've kept you up to date, but we ended up not selling the Glowforge. We found out that it was, they were raising the price by $1,000 on each machine. And um, I thought, hmm. And my daughter was devastated because with the baby, she wanted to make all the baby stuff, but put his name on it. You're going to knock my camera over, miss. Here we go. So she wanted to do that, and she was upset, and I said, oh, no problem. So I called. Oh, I guess I bought another shelf. I called the guy whose wife and her best friend were driving up to Massachusetts from Florida to pick it up, fully expecting to get really yelled at or, and they were so cool about it. I was just so happy um, because they were just like, oh, we're just glad you told us before we left. I said, oh my God, you're wonderful. I don't know if I showed you these. Um, these are for the golf bag um, diaper cake. All right, ribbon. So I bought these colors. There's also a green, but that rolled away. So there's this with green, um, purple, and that's it. There's also a like a striped one for, you know, when the, the, the colors go both ways. I don't know what the word is. But so that's what all this is. Just some ribbon and stuff. And I got this, and I'll show you why in a minute. Put that there. Um, okay, so I got this, which is Wish, Wish Upon a Starfish. And then they had this, which is a crab. And there is another one. Just don't know where it is right now. So then... I guess I bought more of these bottles. Oh, this one, which has the fish on it like this, but different colors. So there were three that were frosted and three that were glass. Well, they're all glass, but you know what I mean. So then there was this, which I guess they were, they were this color and this. So these three. And there was also this one with the same frosted. And this one was clear glass with the metal. 
and I then also got this sign, Life is Better at the Beach. And I mostly got it because I like when they have the little, and I don't have any of those wood pieces. And I don't know if I showed you this one, the anchor and the wheel. And I think I showed you this, the starfish and the crab. I guess I got three. I always think I'm buying two, and I always end up with three of everything. All right, so, oh, I also have been waiting for these to come into my store, which are little baskets. I got the peach and the green, and then the same thing with these two. And I think that might be it, except, oh, so... The thing I wanted this for, and I'm probably um, double it and twist it together or use something thicker, is I made all these t-shirts, onesies for the baby, and I'm just going to kind of hang them with the clothespins. So there's this one, which backwards, but it says, I am the one thing daddy loves more than golf. Sorry, I think we got unplugged when the dog went by. All right, I think we're good. Are we good? All right, and then Daddy really likes playing golf. And then Daddy's little golf friend. I'm proof that my Daddy's not always golfing. And born to play golf with daddy. And I am told I like watching golf. I, I can totally see my son-in-law, you know, sitting on the couch talking to the belly. Um, I like big putts and I cannot lie. And daddy's little player. Daddy's future future golfing buddy. Um, my other stroller is a golf cart. And because, um, because the, the shower is um, the same day as the Masters, um, this is my first green jacket. And uh, Daddy's little caddy. And crawl, walk, golf. And future golfer. And I felt like we were le leaving my daughter out of the whole thing. So this says, my mom doesn't golf, but she loves the 19th hole. So I thought that was cute. And I believe... That is it. Wow. Who knew? That was quick. Well, for me it was. Um, oh, I also wanted to ask you. I, these bunnies, I have not, I will cover the back. Um, a lot of people are making them and they put the pom-pom tail right here. And if you look at it, if the, if the ear's folding like that, it, this has to be the front. So you wouldn't put the bunny's pom-pom here. That would be the little bunny's private area because also the feet go this way. So this has to be the front. Anyway, when I make bunnies and dogs and whatnot, if they're cutesy, I always put a heart upside down for the nose because you're usually drawing that anyway. And then I take a smaller nose, smaller heart, and put that the right way. Um, these hands are made from a heart. I just cut the bottom of the heart off. I use little hearts for here and there. And then just the Happy Easter made on my cricket. What's the little one called? The little one, because I can't think of it. And these came from Dollar Tree also. I just painted those. So I am going to do, 
if anyone's interested, I'm going to paint this again, make the eyes open a little bit, change it up a little. So if anyone is interested in, in seeing how I did this or that, leave a message in the comments. And if nobody wants to see it, then I won't do it. And, uh, yeah, so I'm going to use this with the little um, clothespins. And I just thought it was cute. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you're there, um, I appreciate you shop <laughs> stopping by. I hope you have a great day. And um, I'm going to try and put one more video video out before Easter. But, yeah. I'm going to try. Oh, I should have plenty. Yeah, I'll definitely get one or two. After the shower, I mean, not Easter. Okay, so, right, Bay? Right? My um, dog's groomer, she used to come to the house and did it right in her van. I loved it because I hate when you drop your dog off. Thank you. And they keep her in a cage until they have time. To do it i just hate that so i love that she came to the house so she no longer is doing it and one of the reasons is um the gas prices which must be a lot to run that because the truck runs the whole time she's here and um so we're trying to find a new one that's why she looks so like a little mop head but I really do appreciate you coming by. Oh, I didn't mention they also have chicken wire for the first time. I didn't get this today, but for the first time, we have chicken wire. So that is it, right, babe? So thank you so much for stopping by. I really appreciate it. And um, leave a message in. Why don't we do this? Leave a message um for something just leave me a message a comment and i will put two rolls of vinyl um as a prize i'll draw a name and um yeah so we'll do that give away a prize so you guys have a great rest of the week and i will uh be watching for the comments and then we will pick a winner so thanks again. I really appreciate it. And if you wouldn't mind clicking the like, sharing, making a comment, it's um, really what I need to get um, YouTube to start noticing my stuff and possibly get more people to my channel. I really would appreciate it. So have a great week and I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.